Hi everyone, it's Judy Lee here and welcome to the second week of our collab. And this week is tags. So I just wanted to show you, I made this one, it's completed. Um, it was just an embossed folder um, on some paper I think Miss Edie gave me and I cut it down to a tag, punched the hole and just put some stuff through it. Um, then I added a half of a stained uh, doily um, and a card that came in one of the packages. Um, then some stamps that came in the ephemera package. Uh, just some strings I had around. Um, and then uh, one of my flowers that I made. And uh, I called that done. I just put some laces through here that were tea dyed or coffee dyed and then some others. Um, but I thought that turned out really cute. These I also made and they are plain as you can see. They're fully done except for you know if I want to add a pocket or if I want to you know decorate but I figure out wait because you know, you never know what you might want for a journal, so I saved those. But today, I'm going to be doing these smaller ones that are not cut on the edge. This one is all done. Um, I made a little pocket. Um, I just cut it with my, uh, those fancy scissor things, you know, uh, with a zigzag on it or whatever it is. Um, and, uh, so I cut that and then I just, uh, um, you yeah, know, put some dye around it, brought it out and, uh, stuck a tag, a uh, thing in there so y'all could see it was a tag. Um, then I just put some material under here, raveled it a little bit, um, a stamp, some lace underneath that. And then this butterfly was a cutout. I cut it out. I hand cut it out. Um, out of some material. I don't remember. Uh, it was on a paper anyway. And I cut it out. And then I just added some uh, glare glue. And, uh, to make it prettier. And it does have green in there. You just can't see it. And then I just added two little rhinestones. Or flat bags. But I thought that turned out real well. So I left it to finish up my hole and to do the tag. So with this one, I'm going to do it. And the only thing I've done so far is I did do the hole on it and put my ribbon through. Um, I went ahead and distressed the edge of this. And this needed Fabri-Tac, which I'm going to be using Fabri-Tac anyway. But I wanted it to be dry. So I done it ahead of time. Um, but I wrinkled this one up because I like it that way. So we are going to glue this down and I'm just using my art glitter glue. That's my favorite. If I don't have it handy, I'll do my tacky glue. The uh, Aleens, you can get at Dollar Tree or any crafty store or at Walmart. Uh, I usually buy two bottles of the small at Dollar Tree and add it to my regular Aleens thing because it sits up whenever you're using it so I don't have to worry about it dripping anywhere or have to worry about it not coming out. Okay so we got that pocket done. Sorry. Get this loose stuff up because I don't want it sticking to my card or my tag. Alright, we got that glued down. So we are going to start decorating because um, this is finished except for decorating. Um, I set out a pretty good bit of stuff out here because I didn't know what I was going to use. Um, but I'd already figured out because of time restraints. Figured y'all yeah, don't want to be on here is no longer than you have to watching these. So um, I went ahead and I used some glitter glue 
uh, stickles, whatever you got. Um, and I used it for these, uh, this rose. It's just a long strand, strand uh, thing of roses that uh, I got from Teresa. And I thought that would be gorgeous down here at the bottom. And I just, like I said, used some glitter glue and put it on there just so it looked like dew drops. Um, it's just clear. And uh, I'm going to mash a little bit to make sure they're on here. And then I also glitter glued a uh, butterfly punch that uh, I think it was Victoria it sent me a whole thing of different butterflies or it might have been Miss Edie one or the other but um so we're going to glue it down it's going to be a lit on the rose let's see that we stick it right there you can always add some more glitter glue Okay, see, it's just sitting there on the roses, and it is a difference. Um, Y'all can't see it, but I can. Um, <coughs> and um, I had some of these, but I'm not sure if I want to use those or not. Um, I had thought about putting one on each side. I'm not sure if I'd like that or not. I think we will. All right. I'm going to go ahead and put a little Fabri-Tac uh, while it's still open. And, uh, these are sticky flatbacks, but y'all know how that goes. When stuff will come apart. They don't stick very well for something that's going to last. So I'd advise you to go ahead and glue it down. And there we have that tag done. Now you can cut your, you know, edges off if you want to. I don't want to on this one. Um, I got this little ticket here. Show y'all that it does have the pocket. <coughs> Excuse me, I haven't drank anything. Let me get a drink of my coffee. Oh. Okay, now I had a lot of these. And I just distressed them with some distress ink. You can color them with markers, whatever you want to do. Oh. <coughs> but I like these. It enforces, it reinforces it. And I don't have to bring out my big guns, which is the, uh, what do y'all call that thing? Um, the eyelet gun. <laughs> I don't remember what it's called. But <clears throat> anyway, so um, I already had some strands of different colored greens and uh, dyed uh, uh, lace that I was going to use for this because um, I'll show y'all in a minute why. I go ahead and get this stuff together because otherwise I'd be on here for like 25 30 minutes <laughs> and it shouldn't take that long <clears throat> so I want to be I try to be kind of pre-prepared so that uh, you can see and there it is it's all done I put the I forgot what you call these things. Um, but anyway, uh, I just had a hole punch there, so I just put the rings around it, uh, front and back. And uh, I think they turned out really cute. And I'm going to show y'all, because <clears throat> I decided I'm doing a, if you've lasted this long, leave me a comment down below you have to be a subscriber you have to be 18 or older and 
Um, I don't think that's either. Um, <clears throat> leave me a comment and tell me which of these three is your favorite. You've got, um, <clears throat> I would call this a cream color, pink and green. Cream, pink, and green. So just let me know which one's your favorite. And uh, when I do the giveaway, uh, when I draw your name, if you picked out one of these, that's what you're going to get. You will get whichever one you picked out. Um, I will do the drawing. This is Friday. Well, no. This is Wednesday. This will be coming out the 10th. Um, I will do the drawing. Oh, let's give y'all till. Well, now it's a holiday weekend. Okay, we're going to draw Friday, the 12th. I will make a video drawing on the 12th <clears throat> of anyone that commented the color that's their favorite. Let me know which tag is your favorite. This one is not a pocket now. This is just a regular tag. Um, but these do have the pockets. Um, and these are all finished. So just let me know in the comments. And hit that thumbs up, please. And uh, I'm going to try to move this one. I can see this one really good. Let's see. Let me have to pick them up one by one. There's the green. Here's the pink. Oops. And then here's the cream one. All right. That's all you have to do. You don't have to send me anything. Just let me know which one's your favorite. And if you're chosen, that's what you'll be getting in the mail. Thank you so much for watching. There may be a few other little things. You know, I might put some little extras on there. Um, but thank you for watching. And please hit the like button or dislike. But I'd rather you hit the like button. And uh, I hope you all en are enjoying um, <clears throat> our videos. And... Uh, can't wait till next week. You never know what we're going to be doing. Please watch and uh, go and check out um, Edie and Victoria's once again. Um, I will have their links below. Um, and uh, I hope y'all are joining in and doing these too. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, use up your scraps. These were scrap pieces of paper. Um, and scrap pieces of things that I just had around here. Oh, I was going to tell you. This is why. This is why I pick out everything ahead of time. Because this is all my laces. And I have um, pretties in here. And, I mean, they're all... Um, I know where they're at and and everything. This is my little papers, uh, pretty papers and stuff. Um, like I say, that's that. And I got the laces all over my buttons and stuff, which I have in here. And this is um, ribbons and stuff that people have sent me. Um, just there's pieces and stuff, but I set aside a few pieces here and. Uh, eyelash, these are tiny pieces of eyelash trim um, that were in my scrap bucket, which I've seen many times. Um, so, yeah. Um, <clears throat> and my little punch. Uh, and my fabric All my glues are right here. I have them. They're all in these bottles. Oh, I can't see them. They're all in these bottles. <clears throat> and uh, there's all my brushes and all that good stuff with my distresses. Uh, my journal is over here. And it's falling. I'm sorry if I'm making y'all dizzy. I'm so sorry. 
I got my tape dispenser and my little bitty distress inks. Um, my distress crayons, which I have not used yet. Um, but I'm thinking I'm going to use them to do some of these. Um, and then my stick oils, but I still have my all my glitter glues right here because I use those as well. Um, <clears throat> but anyway, that's why I try to do focus on things that I'm going to need on here. I have these extras right here that I thought I might use on the pink, but I didn't. So they will go back in their little spots in my own thing. And I'm going to continue to make some more of these so I can have a whole lot of them ready to go to the And um, I can't, oh, good luck to everyone. Can't wait to see who wins. Thank you. Bye.